and welcome to another video with me, Elmo J. Kajulainen. You can call me this guy if that's tricky to pronounce. It's good to have you along. Today I'm taking a look at some really weird things to play guitar with. Eight, to be exact, or nine, to be less exact. So, be right back after this intro. <laughs> So let's just jump right straight into it. Number one. Now this is something you might have seen if you watched Paul Gilbert or Eddie Van Halen. It is a drill. Yes, this might just be the least novel thing that you can play guitar with because Eddie Van Halen's done it, so it's hugely popular already. Paul Gilbert has also done it. He actually put picks uh, here so that he could play insanely fast tremolo picking as if he isn't fast enough as it is. Okay, number two. Yes, remote controls. They give off sound, great, uh, and they all have slightly different types of sounds, so you might want to experiment and see which remote is the best for you. Let me know in the comments which one you prefer. <laughs> okay, next one is the mitten. <laughs> now you might be thinking, what the actual f Well, if you're cold and you have to play a gig, you can play gigs using a mitten. Yeah, and it's it's an entire whole mitten. You can use two mittens, but that becomes exceedingly difficult to do because of the right hand mechanics or picking hand mechanics if you're left handed. Yes, but a mitten really is one weird piece of thing to play guitar with. Next one! I've lost count already. <laughs> Yes indeed, it's a comb, which is great for those gigs when you're playing outdoors and the wind is blowing and your hair is all over the place. You never need to have another bad hair day when playing guitar if you use a comb while playing. <laughs> win win! Uh, I got this one from good old Matthias E.R. Eklund. He is a brilliant cat and he has a song called Must. I don't know how to say that, uh, but... The link is in the description and he's played parts of it with a comb. Great stuff. Next one, this thing. You can of course use it for slide as well. thing you can use this for, it's a multi-purpose tool, is playing chords, which is really weird.
Next one. Yes indeed, it's a chopstick. I guess you could have two of these and have a Chinese meal while you're playing guitar. That would be tasty. Um, again, I got this from Matthias E. I. Eklund. He has a song called Chopstick Boogie and I'll link to that in the description as well. He's a creative Swedish Viking guitar person. Next one! A towel! Now, this is actually more practical than a mitten because sometimes you might just find yourself wiping sweat from your brow uh, during a really warm gig. And you notice your solo is up and uh, that's because you might be playing this riff. And now it's your solo, so what do you do? You just stop wiping and do this. <laughs> And if you really want to amaze the crowds, you can do, you can use a mitten and a towel. Next one is children's toys. Or if, I don't know if this is an adult toy. Anyway, children's toys. <laughs> This, honestly, might be the worst thing anyone has ever invented because it makes two different things. And the rest of the things are not in the same key. It's horrible, it's terrible. And our kids used to have two of these. Yeah, we quickly dip disposed of them. The toys, not the kids. Okay, last one and Personally, this might be my favorite. It's a laser. Now I know what you're saying, that's not really different to a children's toy, children's that's not really different to a children's toy because it's a children's toy. This is not a toy. Yes, it's the real deal. It shoots lasers or something. I don't know. Um, but it's great fun. <laughs> How terribly musical. So those were the things that I had for you today. I lost count at some point. I think it was nine things where you could debate if two things were one thing and the mitten and the towel were also closely related because they were cloth. So it might be seven, it might be eight, or it might be nine weird things to play guitar with. That's all I have for you today. I hope you liked what you saw. Give it a thumbs up if you did. Give it a thumbs down if you didn't. And hey, let me know which one yours would use. 
and let me know which one was your favorite and if I forgot something, if you know some other really weird thing to play guitar with, put that in the comments as well. Uh, I'd be interested, interesting, interested to try it out. Uh, subscribe if you haven't already, hit that bell notification thing and support me on Patreon because I buy the silly things that I play guitar with so I can play guitar more and buy more silly things. <laughs> no, but seriously, you get uh, a bunch of exclusive stuff on Patreon, so check that out. And if you want free music, there's a link to my website below where you can find free music. So, that's all I have for you today. Take care. See you in another one. Goodbye. <laughs>